Hey, what's up, YouTube? You're Vulcan Collecting back for another unboxing. Today, I have something for, uh, coming to us from Retro Protection. I have talked about them before in my previous video on how to protect your N64 games, which is a really good video. If you haven't seen it, I would recommend go checking it out. It has a lot of good information in it on how to just protect. You know, you can extend that same logic to any type of game. It doesn't just have to be an N64 game. You know, you can get the same stuff and protect your NES games that way, SNES games, you know, Sega Genesis. You could even get acrylic cases for, you know, your games that are already coming in plastic cases, like your GameCube games, your Wii games. I mean, that's essentially what, like, grading a game is. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, try to get this as op open as quickly as we can without damaging anything. Shout out to Dan from Retro Protection. He's a really cool guy, very nice. I ordered a bunch of uh, console box protectors and a box protector for a uh, a pair of Joy Cons that I have. So I don't think there's anything else left in there. See what comes inside. I don't know what these are. Uh, stickers, it seems like, to keep everything sealed. We have. It looks like some more little stickers. These are like little clear plastic stickers that he threw in. Um, there's his business card. Shout out to Dan again. Go buy stuff from him. Yeah, he makes good shit. All his box protectors are really nice. So these are all of them right here. Uh, let's go ahead and just look at this little uh, Joy-Con one for uh, reference. Let's go ahead and put this one together real quick. So you have to peel off all the film all over first. Oh, I'm sure this is satisfying for some people. Let me get that way more on camera. Leave a comment below if this is satisfying. Here, let's go. I realize that if it's going to be satisfying, I should probably like shut the fuck up for it. Sorry. Don't mean to use bad words. All right, so now that it's all peeled off, you take it, you fold it up. I usually kind of like to break it in a little bit by over folding it, you know, folding everything in and out a couple times, just so that it's not so stiff anymore and it kind of holds its shape when you close it up. Just like so. All right, and then you, of course, just like any other kind of box, Tuck all the flaps in. They, can, they do a really good job of keeping themselves closed. So I'm gonna put that there. Let me go grab uh, some Joy Cons to put in there. You, know, you take your valuable collectible and you slide it in. And then you seal it up. And there you go. Now your item is very well protected, UV resistant. And you can put it on your shelf and not worry about the bottom getting scratched or anything like that. So I'm going to do a little quick cut right here. Put all these together. There's some Wii U box protectors, some Nintendo Wii box protectors, and a Switch box protector. So I'm going to go ahead and put these all together. And then we'll come back and I'll show you everything off once it's all done and ready. All right. Give me a second. All right. And we are back. That took me about 40 minutes to peel off all the plastic and fold together all these uh, different box protectors, but now we're done. So let's go ahead and uh, let's put a, let's put one of these consoles in here. So this is the Switch box protector, fits perfectly. Um, and all these, most of these all fit multiple sizes. So this just doesn't only fit the original Switch. It also fits like the Super Smash Brothers Switch. I think the Animal Crossing one as well. You know, it's not exclusive to these sizes. They fit multiple things. And so, yeah, that's going to be it for today. Thanks for uh, watching the video. Big shout out to Retro Protection. They could provide you box protectors for anything from Switch to your Wii U, even to the old Nintendo Wii. So, yeah, check them out. Give them a, give them a good little look at. Check out their box protectors. They're really nice, high quality. And uh, it's the only thing, it's the only place I buy from. So that's going to be it for today, guys.
Excuse me. Hope you have a great one. <laughs> and take care.